Yo, what is good, buddies? Welcome back to Beaker's Lab. My name is Beaker, and we are checking in with my sick town on my base today. What's up, dude? And before we do that, actually, I want to say one thing. We just got to 200,000 subscribers on YouTube, and it's all you guys, man. You guys like the videos, subscribe, you comment, you share the videos. That's why I call you my buddies. Secondly, guys, look at this. Here we go. What? 200 walls left? 200k subs? 200 walls left? Yeah, coincidence. <laughs> That's it. Anyway, uh, yeah, we're going to try to get that number down today. Hopefully, we can do at least two or three walls. We'll see how much loot we have. But let's go farm, man. All right, buddies. So if you want a sick base like this guy, not like me, you want to get combo loot. And combo loot is all about stuff like this right here. You try to find a base that has everything. You want everything. You don't want to be going for a base that has just gold, just elixir. Now, we've talked about this a lot. We've talked about combo loot. That's kind of what I say. And it also really matters what league you're in, of course, because you get a league bonus. So I would say this is the sweet spot right here. I'm in Crystal 1. I get a great loot bonus. And I also can find Town Hall 9 bases like this that have a million combined loot. Like, dude, you can't go wrong. So here in Crystal, I'm just I'm just stacking it up, dude. And I can do just a couple of raids a day. It, even, if, even if I don't want to raid much, I just do a couple of raids and I can do walls. <laughs> you know, I, I can do one wall at least. So here we go, we got the queen in here. Look at the poison spell, man, how effective it is in this situation. If I hadn't used the poison, I would have had to use a rage spell on the queen so that just shows you the poison was much more effective so here we go coming around the corner here yeah getting some elixir i love love how this guy's base is set up with like <laughs> dude, look over here like we'll come back but look over here he's got like storages just right next to each other it, it looks so funny dude he's max i don't think he really cares about loot i wish he had kind of like put it all on one side made it a little easier but anyway that's not how life works. So we're trying to go in here with our queen. She's still got the healers following her. And then we got this crew right here. And this is just a normal farming army, you know, with Valks in the clan castle. That's usually how I roll. I have some Valks or wizards or both in the clan castle. And man, it is just, it's so deadly. Like, look, we have the heroes, sure, but they're not that high level. They help. They help a lot. But I think the biggest help here, well, besides the queen, is the clan castle, the Valkyries. Just two or three Valks. So they got through the core there, crushed everything, and now it's a question of, uh, can we get these? I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know if we can. The thing is, though, we already have almost 300,000 of each resource and a bunch of dark. So that, that's another reason to hit a base with combo loot because, you know, if you only get half of it, who cares? Who cares, bro? So <laughs> another weird thing about this base, <laughs> did you guys see how all the air defense were like, they were kind of like on one side? Yeah, it's kind of interesting. And now, so there's still one left because I, I wasn't anywhere near it. So yeah, my healers kind of got wrecked there, but there's two left. So we can survive for just a little bit longer. Whoa, whoa, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> All right, we're, we're in the clear. Sadly, there's no real loot up at the top here. So we're not really going to get anything else. I wish I could get that, man. Oh, man. There's 250,000 right there. And we're not even going to get anywhere near it because we only have five seconds left. We used a big army but it wasn't that big. And we used a bunch of spells, but it wasn't that many. We used three and a couple of dark spells. Hey, we could have used four, you know what I mean? So when you're doing combo loot raids like this, you want to try to use the least amount of resources. You know, if you can save a spell, if you can save a couple of troops, you do it. You do it. And, and it makes your, um, your overall profit, of course, more. Anyway, let's go uh, check out some more raids, do some live raids. Let's go. So we got a base here that's more like what we normally take. Something easy. Dude, easy is good. E easy is so good. So <laughs> right here, we're going to do a normal queen walk in the corner of the base. We're going to try to get down a little bit. And yo, we could actually get these storages from outside of the base, I think. I think if the queen sat like right there, like right in the corner, she could get these storages. However, I'm not sure she's going to want to do that. She might want to do her own thing. So let's see what she wants to do. What, what, what do you, you want to do? What, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? You know, I wanted her to go down the side here because look, she can reach that air defense right there from, you know, that, that space there is, she can reach that. Why can't I like speak today? She can reach that. So a Tesla pops up. That's kind of dangerous, but it's going to get taken out by the queen. Boom. And skeleton traps, dude. That's also dangerous. Like if she's getting nailed by the queen or something and skeleton traps pop up, 
they can really troll you. But in this case, we're just, ah, oh, dude, we're just cruising along smooth. Super smooth. What? what? No! <laughs> smooth, right? Smooth, Beak! Yeah, that's smooth too, man! Yeah! You're doing sick, Beak. So sick. So now, thankfully, the queen actually did kind of what I wanted her to do. I wanted her to get in there and kill the enemy queen, and she decided to do that, man. It's like a miracle. So over here, we're just gonna start with our army. You don't want to wait too long when you're using this queen walk raid because your queen will die. I mean, she's going to be on her own up there. So we want to get into the base as quickly as we can. We put a rage spell down for the queen up there. Yeah, so she can take out some storages. She got the queen taken out. Now we're going to go in here and notice we do have a ton of wizards this time. This was a bad example, but I like have like tons of dark troops and wizards on this. Look at this. Ah! <laughs> Yo, this was a crazy OP army. I guess this must have been one of the first raids I did today, so I had all these leftover crazy troops. I love it, man. You know, I'm, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna like waste them. I'm gonna use them to get loot, and that's exactly what we did here. So I was thinking, could I get through the core here without a spell? Nah. I ended up putting a rage spell down. You know, you, you want to have something in the middle when you have those heavy buildings, town hall, clan castle. You know, either a heal or a rage helps so much. So there it is, man. Yeah. What, what you doing, king? Oh, you, you're gonna die. Yeah. Even with the king ability, he's gonna die so fast. Dude, you see how long it took him just to get through that level 8 wall? <laughs> I gotta upgrade my heroes, man. Like, that, that was sad. That was so sad. You ever see... Uh, whoops, I just paused it. <laughs> whoops! <laughs> so, let's go over here and then press play. You guys ever see a max hero go up against level 8 walls? It just, like, melts. It just melts. So we want to be able to do that. We definitely want to be able to do that. So we got to keep upgrading our heroes. We'll uh, we'll work on that soon. We'll do some Dark Elixir time episodes. Maybe next episode we'll, we'll start the king. So here it is. We're going to get a little bit more elixir. And this is what, of course, you want to happen. You want to get all the storages. We did not quite get there. But hey, it's all good, man. Cool. That was fun. <laughs> I, I, had, I had a lot of fun with these raids. So let's go do a live one right now. See if we can find something like this. Let's go. All right, buddies, we're going to do some searching right now. I'm going to show you guys a couple of the bases that I skip. Like right here. You know, no, we're not going to take that. And another thing that has been really hard for me to, to learn how to do is to skip bases with just Dark Elixir. Okay, I think that's the toughest one. So if we see a base with like 3,000 Dark, but it has nothing else, it has no gold, no Elixir, you know, we don't really want to take that. If we're farming walls, we really want to focus on everything. We want everything. Right here is a good example. We've got good gold, good dark, but not really elixir. So if we get everything, it's really gonna help us. Like, honestly, I think I might take this. Like the dark sucks. It's only 1500, but I think we should, I, th I still think we should take it because the gold and elixir is good. Also, this is my favorite base. You guys know that? This is 100% the base. I love to attack more than anything. It's perfect for a queen walk army. So we're gonna start, um, we're gonna, ooh, where are we gonna start? We're gonna start, uh, <laughs> I guess we're gonna start at the top here. Let's go, here we go, here we go, here we go. All right, all right. Let's put, uh, once the archer tower gets distracted, which she is right now, we're gonna start to put some minions down. We wanna take out these side buildings here as quickly as possible, so I actually put four minions down. That may have been a few too many, but, you know, it's, it's better to just get it done. We just wanna get that done. So she goes to the left. Now, I think we'll just charge in from this bottom here and everything should work. We're definitely gonna have to save some troops uh, till the end just to snipe some buildings. It looks like some of the buildings around, like at the top there, have a bunch of resources in them. So we'll try to save some archers and stuff. So keep going, keep going. Um, it doesn't look like we're gonna activate the queen from this angle, so we'll get her when we get into the middle. Also, I hope I have some poisons. Yes, I do, I have two poisons. Perfect. I'm just gonna like make it rain when we get to the middle. Just drops, <laughs> just drops tons of spells. So keep going, queen. Keep going. Keep going. All right, cool. So now that the queen, queen, queen has rounded that corner. Whoa! We want to use the queen ability to keep her alive, and I'm gonna start to drop some archers, giants, stuff over here, just to take a little heat off of that queen. Here we go. Here we go. I don't want to drop all my giants because there's definitely a bomb in there. Watch. Yeah, there it is. Ah! Okay, now we're gonna drop some more troops. Here we go. Save about um, that many. We'll, we'll save that many troops. <laughs> that many troops. Okay, here we go, here we go. Let's see if we can get in here without using a jump. Go, 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 go. What, there's a golem? What? <laughs> drop, drop the boys 
doesn't know. Oh, dude, that golem's gonna troll me. That golem's totally gonna troll me. Because... Uh, when the golem dies, it explodes and it does a bunch of damage. And it probably it probably really wrecked my Valks. Anyway, get over the wall, dudes. Get over the wall. Get over the wall. Uh, <laughs> I don't know which wall we should have gone over. I usually try to go over the back wall like we did there. I guess it's sort of working. We're sort of slowing down here, but... Uh, oh, queen died. No. Anyway, we did okay here. We definitely did okay. I want to snipe a little bit more loot right here. Let's get that. Let's get that. And let's, while we've got some distractions up here, like that giant on the inside is distracting for us, uh, let's get a little bit more. Cool. Yeah. So maybe we should have used another rage ball here, but, you know, it ended up being fine. We got most of the loot, and we had, we had fun, dude. I love crushing this base. This, this is one of the most fun bases to crush. I don't know why, dude. I don't know why. It's just like when you get into the middle there and all your dudes are just in one spot and they, they get really like packed in there because it's such a small core and then you drop a spell, but it's just done. So anyway, that's it, man. Uh, <laughs> let's go back to base and do some walls. We did get some combo loot there. And if you count in the loot bonus and it ends up being pretty good. And that's how I've, you know, that's how I've gotten this far with walls. So let's go back to base, buddies. See what we can do today. We've got uh, some good loot here. What do we got? What do we got? We've got enough to do three walls, right? Let's see if we have anything in the treasury. Yeah, we do. Yeah. All right. What's it? How much is it? Yeah. All right. Cool. It doesn't change anything. We can still do three walls. So are we recording? Yeah. <laughs> cool. You just got to check, you know, you just got to check. So let's request some troops, Valks and poison. Most OP combo ever. And let's start to do walls right, I guess, here. We'll just do some of these. So there's one with gold. There's one with elixir. Yeah, I can't see you, bro. Can't see you. All right, there it is. And one more with elixir. Yes. Now we have, what, 197 left? And we've done 53 max walls. <laughs> That's sick, man. So even though I don't have expos, even though most of my defenses are not that good, I'm, I'm still psyched on this base, man. I, I think this is a great base. I'm, I'm happy with it. I, I have so much fun playing on it. So hope you guys enjoy watching our, our farming series, whether it's Dark Elixir time or, you know, when we do walls like this or when we just do war or anything. Let me know if you guys enjoy it. Anyway, 200,000 subscribers, man. Again, you guys are so sick. That's why I call you my buddies because we've got a really, like, <laughs> we've got a really great group here. You guys are awesome. So let me know how you're doing, guys. I'll see you next time. Peace.